and today I'm going to be making a tutorial on how to uh, merge two IPSW files together so uh, in this example we're going to be using iOS 8.3 and iOS 8.4 IPSW files um, so first you're going to need two programs one is iDecrypte and the second one is Tasma. I'll leave links in the description so you can download those and um, I'll also show you how to get these IPSW files so now what you want to do is open up your web browser. I'm going to be using Microsoft Edge here. Now find your iDevice. So I'm going to be using the iPhone 5 here. Uh, make sure it's the correct version because there's iPhone 5.1 and iPhone 5.2. So I'm going to be using the iPhone 5.2. So um, just set, uh, just click on the one you're going to be modifying. So uh, 8.3 for me. And then just copy the key. Uh, you can also download the IPSW files here and by the way they've released um, iOS 8.4 key so um, there's no need for merging but I'm still making the tutorial so in the future when iOS 8. Point, I mean iOS 9 is released you can merge iOS 8.4 with iOS 9 so here's the key for that and you can also download it so you wanna rename these two uh, IPSW files to .zip so I'm just gonna do that here so after you've done that just open up the iOS 8.3 file uh, or the one that you're gonna be modifying so for me it's iOS 8.3 alright so find the biggest file here and drag that out well, yours is probably gonna start with a 1 but why mine is starting with a 2 is because um, I've already decrypted it beforehand just to save more time and um, there will also be uh, some information on why we merge two files together in the description so be sure to check that out if you are confused with anything So after you've done that, just um, close this out and um, open up I decrypt it. So just paste that key in and select the input file. All right, and then just click decrypt it. Uh, but I'm not gonna do that as I've told you earlier. I've already decrypted it just to save time. So just close that out and um, after you've decrypted it, open it with Transmac. So just double click on that. So now what you want to do is go into um, System, Library, then find Core Services. Uh, and then uh, just drag systemvision.plist out. So you're going to need um, Notepad++ or plist editor. For to open this, so I'm just gonna open it with Notepad++. So now you wanna rename this from iOS 8.3 to whatever version you're merging with. So mine is iOS 8.4 I'm merging with. So, and then the build you want to um, replace that with um, the iOS 8.4 build because that's the one we're merging with so just um, copy that and paste in here alright so after you've done that just uh, control S to save it uh, close that out. and then replace it now drag it back in and replace it with uh, the one that's already in there so just uh, click that and click OK. So now what you want to do is just uh, close this. And so after you've done that, just open up the iOS 8.4 file, IPSW file, and um, copy the name of the biggest file here. So it's this one, and then uh, rename this file and paste that in. So Control V. All right. So after you've done that, just um, replace this file with this one so just drag it in but I'm not gonna do that um, just to save time um, then close that out rename this back to IPSW 
and you're done. So if I've helped you in any way uh, in this tutorial by making this tutorial please be sure to subscribe and like this video for more videos like this in the future. Thanks for watching. Bye.